Good afternoon to you viewers and subscribers. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. By now, you must have known that when you want to learn about engineering, structural engineering, construction engineering, and architecture, this is the channel for you, right? So in today's video, I'm going to showcase to you my last project. My last project is an apartment complex consisting of four two-bedroom units that is slated to be constructed in the parish of Clarendon in the district of Denby. So I've finished off the design and the working drawings last year, October, and I have submitted it. The owner has submitted it to the Clarendon Municipal Corporation. We have gotten the approval for the project. I think it was January of this year. And so far, construction has been has been commenced. We commenced construction, I think it was early March or in the middle of March, there about. So I'm just here to show you a 3D view of the drawing consisting of four views, the front, the back, and left side, and the right side, as well as a couple of sheets of the working drawings and a couple of videos that I have taken on site while I was in Jamaica. So stay tuned for the video. And as usual, watch the video until the end. And remember to subscribe, like, and share, and leave a comment. All right? Stay tuned. So like I've said in my introduction, I'm going to show you a couple of pages of what the working drawings is consist of. So as you can see on screen here, this is the site plan and of course the site plan is the setting out of the building on the property so setting out the site plan setting out the building and property we have to ensure that we have the proper setbacks from the center line of the roadway here so this is the center line here and the building is set out i think 40 feet from the center line of the roadway and of course since it's an apartment complex we have to i have to introduce parking on the property to show that if there's any visitor that comes to the property and the owners they, they can park on the property without causing a congestion on the roadway so the parking i think it is one two three four five six seven eight so we have eight parkings in total and of course these are our drainage system we have a soak away or reed bed and our septic tank manholes and trap gully basin as you can see so this is a building here set out on the property so that is what is going on where the site plan is 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 um is entails right so I'm going to show you what the floor plan is. So the floor plan is pretty, pretty, is pretty much simple. You know, many contractors have told me throughout the years that my drawings are very, very easy to read and very, very straightforward. I don't practice doing complicated drawings. You know what I mean? That's the hallmark of my practice. I do simple drawings, readable, easy to execute, easy to build. Right? So it's just basically two bedrooms. The property, the design is consists of four two bedroom units right each independent of each other so we have a, a, a master room here or a primary room which is own bathroom here and suite bathroom walk-in closet bedroom here bathroom here right open concept living and dining your kitchen area your rear porch a little wet area let me zoom up a little bit so you can see a little bit more where the floor plan is concerned so we have a little wet area here you can store your map are your laundry stuff are your, your cleaning stuff and then you have the laundry here where you can do your washing and there's a stairs leading to the back of the premises so i said pretty much simple bedroom here master mom primary bathroom bedroom closet bedroom open concept living dining a front porch kitchen laundry wet area rear porch and this is a mirror of what is going on on the other side so basically the same layout on the, on the other side and at the top right and of course this is your stairs that lead up to the upper floor onto this side 
and this is the stairs that lead you up to the upper floor on this side so one stairs take you to the left on the upper floor and the other stairs take you up to the right on the other floor all right so pretty much easy straightforward easy to read so this is what the upper floor is consist of again just a replica replica of the first floor okay and of course you have a lower roof that go over the entrance of the of the, the the access to the upper floor right on the left and on the right all right this is a foundation plan this is our this is my roof plan here right so that's a roof framing plan and this is the front elevation the east elevation otherwise known as the east elevation and this is your west elevation right otherwise known as your your left elevation and of course this is your south elevation which is known as the as the 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 the, the, the right elevation and this is the north elevation left elevation right and of course i think this elevation is your rear elevation sorry the west elevation is going to be the 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 back elevation and the east the front and and of course the north and the south is going to be your left and right elevation respectively so that's basically what the the drawings consist of obviously you know you go through the drawings there you know they are, these are just basically engineering details but that's the main aspect of the drawings right so if you take a closer look at the front elevation here make sure you look at the front elevation closely and see if it mimics what is going to be outlined on the 3d views all right so that is it with the working drawings is concerned so as i said uh, we have gotten approval and construction is now being executed at the project site all right so i'm going to show you a couple of videos on-site videos that i've taken while i while i was in jamaica visiting the project all right good so this is one of my site visits i just turned up to the site and was inspecting the foundation and was pointing out a few things on the site you know to ensure that everything is going good so what i observed they have put in their stiff down mountain base which is good so that helps us to strengthen the building to ensure that the building is stable especially especially from the foundation up so this was just this was just merely me passing by the side checking up on the reinforcement and see how is it go how it, how it was going at the time you know what i mean so yeah so i was pretty much pleased i didn't find any major concerns you know i should have been there when they were putting when they begin putting in the reinforcement there's a few things that uh you know i might have, might have done differently i'll point it out differently but um all in all it it looks pretty good and the building looks to be well designed and can carry the impended loads you know i was pretty i was pretty much impressed with what i see so far you know when i visit at that time the concrete look good you know what i mean the the stiffener base goes in you know so i was pretty much encourage based on what i've seen on the sites on that day that i visited yeah yeah so yeah but this is just to show you that i do carry out site visits on some of my projects while I'm in while I'm in Jamaica.
right? So if I do a project for you and I manage to be in the country, you can rest assured that I will pay you a site visit to see if you're building according to drawings and according to what is approved on the drawings. So this is a video that was sent to me by the owner. Um, it, it shows what is going on where the block work is, is consist of. So this is very good. So they have managed to finish pouring the foundation all together and they have begin starting to lay blocks, right? So the block work looks pretty good to me. They look very, the walls that they have put up so far look plumb, look very plumb to me. It doesn't look as if it is leaning to one side or the other. So the block work look pretty good to me. Yeah, I have no problems with it so far. The wall is going up very, very plumb and they have gone down with the foundation at the correct depth they're stiff the mountain is in the reinforcement is good so i presume that we are putting up a pretty a pretty strong structure a pretty strong building so i wasn't actually on site when this was done this video was sent to me by the owner to show what what the progress is like at the time of this video Right, so the block work look pretty good. So I'm hoping to see that um, it comes out well. So in the next couple of slides, I'm going to show you what the 3D views look like and what the finished product supposed to turn out to be. So this is the lane of the block work so far. So far, so good. Yes. So folks, viewers and subscribers, this is what the front view look like. So this is what the front of the finished product is going to look like or should look like. So this is a three dimensional view of what the front of the building is going to look like. All right. So you can take a look at it and, you know, let me know what you think of it in the comment section so if the owner executes the building as per drawings and as per finishing this is what the finished product should look like all right so that's the front elevation so let me take you to the remaining views so this is the i think this is the left elevation or the west elevation so this is what the left elevation is supposed to look like right and this is now what the rear or the back of the proposed building is going to look like or should look like owing to the fact that if the building is being executed according to drawings then this is what the back elevation should look like right so again you can take a look at it and tell me if you are pleased or if you are displeased or you know what I mean but more than likely put a positive comment you know what I mean so this is what the right side look like or the east elevation so that's what the four views look like again this is the right side or the east elevation this is the back right or what is known as the north elevation this is the left elevation otherwise known as the west elevation and this is what the front of the building is going to is going to look like all right so let me know what you think about the 3d views i think um it has come out very well and i'm going to see as best as possible to follow up on this project and ensure that it comes out just as how it was designed all right so thank you for watching this video if you have reached this far i hope you 
leave a positive comments like share and if you're a new time viewer of this channel please to subscribe all right thank you and i'm going to catch you in another video upload maximum respect all right good